Hello everybody and welcome to today's Carolina Outdoor Adventures TV. Today we're on a little lake up here in western North Carolina, up here in the mountains. Uh, we're not far out of Asheville, we're in that general vicinity. Shane won't let me tell you where he is because he said he'd have to tie me up out here in the woods and, uh, and leave me. But uh, actually if, if you ever saw the movie uh, Deliverance, that's pretty close to where we're at, but this is a great place up here, beautiful uh, place to fish, and as you're going to probably see here, uh, from what I've seen, what Shane does here when he fishes, you're going to see some really great fish as far as quality of the size for this particular lake. So uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, do a little fishing here and see what we do, and we hope you enjoy the show. And that's all I got to say. Here we go. This week's Carolina Outdoor Adventures TV is brought to you in part by Camelback Hydration Systems. Do you have a camel on your back? Bolet's Sportswear and Sunglasses. By Daiwa Fishing, committed to quality. By Carolina Outdoor Hunting and Fishing Supply. Bait and Tackle, Sense and Attractants. Hummingbird Depth Finder. By Outdoor Pro Gear, real gear for real people and also by CVA. It's just a better gun. There's our first. We found the fish? Our first, I can't tell you what lake we're on fish. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mystery lake. <laughs> Mystery lake fish. Oh, brother. Here we go. Crappy. Crappy, a little bit bigger than the last one I got. Oh, it's a good one. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go, Mr. Crappy. I've been changing a lot of baits. That's one of them ones that you said that was big, but he's awful thin, Shane. Yeah. I've been changing lures like crazy to try to get on the fish here. Well, I just went and ruined that bait, but what I changed to was this dark blue and chartreuse tail uh, jig and it's worked so far that's fairly a nice well fish right yeah, there. that's a good little crappy right there I mean we're plugging our way through trying to still find the fish and um, I guess hopefully here we'll get some uh, get into them pretty quick but we're still trying to find out where they're at today but all right we're gonna get back in the water Well, that's a decent sized little fishy right there. Yeah, it's not too bad. Not real thick, but. No, it's one of them long ones again. Pretty fish anyways. There he is. Crappy. It's good hey. size right there. Nah, that's small. There's some big crappy in here, but. Well, he's fighting though. Hey, boy, he's fighting. That's probably legal size, but.
<laughs> Have fun on these little ultra lights. Ooh. There you go. Nice. Oh. He inhaled that plug. You know what they say, where well, there's one bass, there's two. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. We got another bass, a little bigger. A little bigger. Okay. Not good looking world, fish. Good looking fish. Fine. Later, Fine. dude. That's pretty colored in here. Oh yeah. It's got a little bit of blue in the tail. Catfish! Catfish! The net for this one? It feels like it. It just keeps stripping around. I see my float. Oh, he ain't that. Uh oh. A little better fish. Good eating size. Yeah. That's a sandwich. Get him back in the water here. Ah, it's a Kamala catfish. You think so? Yeah, I just feel him flop his head. Oh, what is this? Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. This thing ain't set up for catfish fighting. Yeah, it will. <laughs> oh, man. Come on back here. Oh, oh we got all. Oh, we had another one. I had another catfish. Come on. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this rod's a little lighter, so I'm just taking my time. Tighten up on the drag a little. Come on up, come on up. I just want to put there. Here he comes, here he comes. Ah, oh, come on, coming up, coming up, coming up, coming up. Oh, oh what a monster. No one. Now, what would I do if I'm going to have to switch rods? What am I going to do if I catch one the size of what Shane caught? Uh, break your rod. I'd be in no, well, it's <laughs> not that, it's my line. It's kind of like it. Uh, oh, there's not, get ready, John, get ready, John, going to go. You're going down, I got a fish. That's bluegill. Bluegill? Bluegill. We'll take it. We'll take it. Nice bluegill. Oh, yeah. This cove is paying off down here now. Pretty nice fish. What we're doing now, everybody, is something you, you, you ought to think about doing is we came down here through this, this, uh, this big cove right here and working the shade. We didn't catch a fish, didn't even get a bite over in the sun. But we come back down the shade and we caught all them fish you saw just a little bit earlier that Shane and myself caught. We turned right around and now we're coming right back up through the same area and we're catching probably right now with just as many fish as we caught coming down. So just what's happening now is we got a lot of sunlight, it's starting to warm up. The fish have moved into the shady areas where it's a little bit cool of water and the sun's not so bright. So just keep that in mind, you know, when you're out fishing. To, don't be afraid to experiment with different things because what you might be doing may not be working out. You might have to change a little bit. <laughs> oh yeah, here we go. Come on, baby. All right, Shane. You need the you need You're the net. Starting to take me off. off. <laughs> Good. He's out of the water. Then hit the fighter. He's out of the water. You think so? I want to get in there. I don't know how big it is, but it's a fighter. Oh yeah. Oh, nice one, nice one. Right here. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a decent sized little channel there. What do you think? What do you think there, Mr. Cameraman? I think that I'm doing a pretty good job with one hand in a camera <laughs> and one hand in a dead gum net. <laughs> yeah. yeah.
<laughs> cameraman, he's, he's double timing today. He's a net man and cameraman. <laughs> Might have to buy him a biscuit at all. <laughs> That's a that's a nice size cat right there, ladies and gentlemen. Great eating size. That's probably what a good two oh, pound, on, maybe. I gotta, hold on, that's probably whacking off here. I'd say that's a little over three, though. A little over three. Nice. Bye, bud. Nice catfish. Nice catfish. Oh yeah. Yep. We'll take him. We'll take him. Open your mouth. I've had too many scars on my fingers from hooks getting hooks out of catfish's mouth and these little pliers right here works the finest ever was for getting them out with it's good looking fish right down. there what do you okay. say shane about how big how big is it about a pound and a half two pound tops Nice little brim, nice little brim. Nothing wrong with that. All right. We went to live bait everybody because it seems like what's happened is they, uh, the, as soon as the sun came out and the fog went away, the bite stopped. So what we thought, Shane says, you know, they got awful big brim in here. So we are switched over right now to brim. I mean, <laughs> yeah, right, no. We're switched <laughs> over right now to worms and night crawlers so we can catch brim, okay? So, well, anyways. That's a hand. Um. We're gonna try that. Shane caught a nice one here just a little while ago. Well, bro, this is a little bit bigger than the last one, I think. What do we got going on here? Look at that. Oh, oh that's yeah. a decent size. Nice one. Wow, Look at that. Enough. Yeah, man. Mm. We could use a whole bunch of them. That's what we're after, folks, right there. You have a bite, Shane? Uh oh, Shane's Missed getting on them, too. Nice fish, nice fish. All right. We'll get him back in and get a little more worm on there and see if we can't get another one. Yeah. Way to go. No, they ain't good. There you go. Good night. Plenty of them that size in here. Let's see, that's what we call a sandwich. Nope. That's a bluegill. Another bluegill. Oh, right in the bag. Oh, see, okay. He wanted to go home. Well, it doesn't really matter. I wanted to take one home to eat. He okay? wanted to go I'm, home. You know, yeah, I wanted to take him home <laughs> and eat him. Just where he is. A bluegill. Oh, a nice brim. Look at that. Dude, look Beautiful at the size brim. of that one. Brim. Got a couple little defects on him, but he's still a nice little fish. There we go. There we go. Now we got a fish. That's another one. Another big one. Let me a uh, little better colors let me get on that. Picture of these bluegills, okay? Because people aren't going to believe. That's a decent size, man. Another really nice pretty one. one. It's that sunburst, man. That is gorgeous. That is right. gorgeous, man. <laughs> a little guy funny thing is that's about the smallest one we've caught today i think and the thing is he's still got that pretty color on it 